MLA for Vancouver, Mount Pleasant. Acting Mayor, Councillor Raymond Louis from the City of Vancouver. Eichiro Ochiai of Vancouver Save Article 9. And Colin Chan, President of the Powell Street Festival Society. Powell Site, スクワミッシュネーションのメアリー・チャーリス様よりお祈りをいただきたく存じます。パワールサイの開催される before we begin, we'd first like to acknowledge that the Powell Street Festival takes place on unceded Coast Salish territory. Oppenheimer Park is on traditional Squamish, Musqueam, and Salmatooth territory. And here to do an opening blessing for the festival is Elder Mary Charles of the Musqueam Nation. to be here to welcome you to our beautiful city of Vancouver, if you're not a Vancouverite yet. And as I say, I'm very honored, and I must thank my daughter, Kathy. She drives me everywhere that I have to go. Thank you, Kathy. And I hope you all are here and enjoy yourself and get to know one another and just enjoy yourself. It's such a beautiful day. As I say, I'm so proud to stand here in front of every one of you. Haichka, Haichka in our dialect is thank you. And as we do in our tradition, I'll start our day with a little prayer. Thank you, Great Spirit, for this new day. So much like yesterday and yet so very special. Thank you for family, friends, casual acquaintances, and strangers I meet only once. They're all part of your plan and in my life for a reason. Bless them today, Great Spirit, as you meet their needs and guide them accordingly to your will. Let us be one with our brothers and sisters in love and peace. Make us strong mentally, physically, and spiritually to lead the way for future generations and make this world a better place to live. May all your blessings and kindness be bestowed on everyone here this morning. Near or far, together or apart, keep our loved ones close until we meet again. May your days be filled with joy. May your successes be frequent. May you have peace and comfort. And may you be loved by each other and everyone. And thank you for this great honor. Haichka, Haichka. Have a great day. Mary Charlie Sama, Arigato Zaimashita. Suzukimashite, Vancouver, Nihon, Ryojikan, Sol Ryoji, Okai Asako Sama Yori, Yoroshiko Negaitashimas. Thank you very much, Mary Charles. Next, we would like to introduce Ms. Asako Okai, Consul General of Japan. Good morning, everyone. Uh, I am new Consul General of Japan, Asako Okai. I arrived uh, three months ago, and this is going to be my first time uh, to participate in this Power Street Festival. I am so pleased that I will be able to uh, uh, participate in this event, uh, which marks the 40th anniversary. Uh, think, come to think of it, it's a wonderful tradition to go on for 40 years. Uh, and I congratulate all of you uh, for celebrating uh, this uh, uh, place, Power Street, for such a long time. As it's been said by my MCs, uh, this is a historical place uh, for us Japanese uh, and then now on to the Japanese Canadians. And I'm so pleased to be uh, uh, back in this place uh, to celebrate this uh, festival. Uh, and then the, uh, I, since I arrived here uh, three months ago and before I come here, 
I saw uh, the uh, film called the Asahi the, uh, the, uh, of Vancouver, which is about baseball or the team. And then uh, when I was told that this festival is uh, taking place in the venue where that team uh, had based, I got so excited. And before even I come uh, uh, participating in this opening ceremony, I walked around and saw many uh, groups uh, in this uh, that festival and so excited uh, to explore further. Uh, for us, uh, the, the Consulate General, as contribution this year, uh, is to fund for the artist, photo player, uh, the uh, Miyama Makuen. And then the, uh, she would play uh, twice uh, during the weekend. And uh, what is interesting for me is that she's a Japanese Australian. And then the, uh, so many artists who would be participating uh, in this event is multinational. And then I am so grateful that the Japanese art and culture is appreciated by this diverse uh, uh, group of people. So uh, I congratulate you on this, and then yeah, I uh, would uh, certainly uh, celebrate uh, this uh, ongoing uh, heritage uh, which will be passed around in the uh, decades. And uh, this year marks uh, the 110th anniversary for the Japanese school as well. And it, it's surprising to see this, all this history uh, going on. And I'm appreciative uh, of the uh, BC government initiative uh, to, to invite the uh, nomination uh, to collect the, uh, all the heritages of Japanese uh, the, uh, descent. And I would certainly encourage you to, to nominate uh, uh, the, wherever you think uh, would be uh, appropriate. But uh, obviously, uh, this power street uh, will be the uh, one of the top, uh, will be one uh, in the top list of that nomination. And uh, I would certainly get excited uh, about uh, seeing all you, all of you, and uh, participating in the uh, the event that uh, you'll be uh, presenting yourself. Uh, so all the best and then enjoy this wonderful day. Thank you very much. Vancouver, Nihon Ryojikan, Soryoji, Okai Asako Sama, Ariatozaimashita. Thank you very much, Consul General. Uh, next we would like to introduce you to Melanie Mark. MLA for Vancouver Mount Pleasant. 続きましてマウントプレゼント地区MLAメラニーマーク様よりご挨拶をお願いいたします。Morning. Good morning, everyone. My name is Melanie Mark, and I'm so honored to be here. I want to first acknowledge that we're gathering on the unceded territory of the Musqueam, Squamish, and tsleil First Nations people. Uh, thank you to the organizers uh, for advocating and moving forward for 40 years to make sure uh, that we celebrate uh, Jap Jap Japantown and the rich heritage of the Japanese community here in the heart of the downtown east side. I have a few remarks uh, that the Minister of Justice has sent, uh, Susan Anton, on behalf of the provincial government. So I'd like to read a proclamation uh, to all, this is my first, to all ye, all ye. Uh, to all to whom these presents shall come greeting. Whereas British Columbia is a province of many ethnicities, festivals, events, cross-cultural understanding, inclusiveness, and respect for one's neighborhood. And whereas British Columbia is a province that gives its people incentives to share cultures and experiences, and British Columbians are eager to learn about each other's cultures and backgrounds. And whereas for 40 years, the Powell Street Festival has celebrated and promoted the history and contributions made by Japanese Canadians in British Columbia by hosting a community arts and cultural festival in the historically significant neighborhood of Vancouver's downtown east side. Whereas the government of British Columbia remains committed to supporting the promotion of arts and culture, acknowledging the historic and current contributions of Japanese Canadian communities, and supporting the festival, here and moving forward. So now ye, we do these presents proclaim and declare that July 30th and 31st, 2016 shall be known as Powell Street Festival Days. So 
those well wishes are on behalf of the government of British Columbia, and I'm glad to send those remarks. I will just conclude by saying it is important that we uh, advocate and fight for social inclusion, uh, that we advocate for the repatriation of our cultural uh, histories and, and the contributions we made in society. I know that last year, Truth and Reconciliation meant a lot to the Indigenous people of Canada. Uh, that fought hard to be acknowledged, to acknowledge their history and to acknowledge their truth and to acknowledge the days moving forward. And the same testament should hold true uh, for the Japanese Canadians here in British Columbia. So celebrate. Thank you everyone for being here. Hawa. Thank you very much, Melanie. I uh, would now like to introduce you to Eichiro Ochiai of Vancouver Save Article 9 and Vancouver City Councillor Andrea Reimer. OCM Andrea Quian Sana, Tane Kla East Vancouver, Unsolaten, Chin Quinman, uh, Mary Charles CM, uh, Ho Masquiam CM, Swaylatooth, uh, Squamish, Hoichka. Uh, I'm not Raymond Louie, uh, who's here, but not on stage. Uh, uh, my name is Andrea Reimer, I'm a city councillor. Uh, I come from East Vancouver. I am very grateful to Mary Char Elder Mary Charles and the Squamish and the Musqueam and the Tsleil-Waututh for the welcome that they give us and to acknowledge the unceded territories. Um, as Melanie said, sorry, MLA Mark said, Melanie Mark said, um, it is an important day to celebrate and um, the tenacity and vibrancy of the Japanese culture in Vancouver um, is something that I've enjoyed since I was very young and my, my grandma lived on Powell Street Last year we celebrated our 50th anniversary with our sister city, Yokohama. The mayor of Yokohama could not believe that not only could I eat with chopsticks, but that I knew what things like Tanzura Soba and Robata and all of the good uh, cultural traditions that we get to share with the Japanese community are. But it's not just a day for celebration, it's also a day for remembrance. Uh, and every year at the opening of the Powell Street Festival, the city of Vancouver uh, building on the good work of past councillors and traditions um, does make a proclamation. So I would invite uh, Mr. Ochia to bring forward the proclamation for me. Whereas August 6, 2016 marks the 71st anniversary of the day when citizens of Hiroshima were devastated by the first use of a nuclear bomb and on August 9th, a second nuclear bomb was exploded over Nagasaki with the consequent horrific loss of life and a lifetime of physical and emotional suffering for the survivors. And whereas we show our solidarity with people around the world who are dedicated to working for peace and the total abolition of nuclear weapons, and whereas we want all roads that lead to peace and bike paths and sidewalks to be kept open, and we invite all organizations working on peace including civic representatives, indigenous peoples, youth, labor, and concerned citizens from around the world to join us in the search for peace with love and understanding among all peoples within our lifetimes. And whereas today we particularly pay tribute to remaining Hiroshima and Nagasaki survivors, now therefore I, Andrea Reimer, on behalf of Mayor Gregor Robertson, Mayor of the City of Vancouver, do hereby proclaim Saturday August 6, 2016, as Hiroshima Day in the city of Vancouver. Thank you. Thank you very much, Andrea. Uh, I'm uh, with the DSA 9, that Vancouver said Article 9. Currently, unfortunately, the Japanese government is trying to change it, uh, but that's another story. Uh, this year, uh, President Obama of the United States visited Hiroshima for the first time since the fateful day of August 6, 1945. 
when the United States dropped an atomic bomb on the human subject for the first time in human history. And three days later, even three days later, they dropped another on Nagasaki city. And those bombs threatened the cities and killed thousands, thousands of people. Since that time, nuclear weapons have proliferated. Many countries are eager to you know, keep and make nuclear weapons. And we're still facing the threat of nuclear war. Even today, it's actually, it's more ominous situation. So we, Vancouver Save Article 9, uh, is now holding an atomic bomb exhibition at the Japanese language school, just one block from here, today and tomorrow. And uh, our theme today, uh, this year is nuclear issues, whole issues, not only atomic bomb, but the other issue as well in 21st century, what we should do, what we can do, and so forth. So please come and take a look at it. Thank you for this meeting. Thank you. Thank you. Andrea Dayama-sama, Ochiai Eiichiro-sama, Doumo arigatou gozaimashita. Tsuzukimashite, MP Jenny Kohan-sama yori goaisatsu o onegai itashimasu. Thank you very much, uh, Andrea Reimer and Mr. Ochiai. We'd now like to introduce MP for Vancouver East, Jenny Kwan. Thank you all very much. And uh, please go over and have a look at the Koinobori if you haven't already. And uh, once the scales start filling in, it'll be a great place to grab a bit of shade as well. It's absolutely beautiful. They did a wonderful job. Uh, thank you very much again to all of our guests who participated in the opening ceremonies. Honma Shinobu sama, James Brown sama, domo arigatou gozaimashita. Konkai no kono Powell Sai no tame ni irashite kudasaimashita. Guests no mina sama, domo arigatou gozaimashita. Finally, we'd like to invite uh, Colin Chan as president of the Powell Street Festival Society to the microphone to say a few words. Hi everyone, uh, I'd like to thank uh, Elder Mary Charles for welcoming us to share your traditional territory uh, for our weekend celebration. And certainly thank you to um, all of our special guests for uh, helping to kick off this festival weekend. Um, as mentioned earlier, uh, this is indeed our 40th annual festival, and this is our biggest one yet. We've doubled the size of our site. Uh, last year we had our largest crowds ever, and so we've expanded our site to have more programming, more food, and uh, hopefully a lot, a lot of fun too. So for newcomers to the festival, as, as our crowds grow every year, this park, was, this park and the surrounding area was once home to a thriving Japanese-Canadian community prior, prior to World War II. And our annual festival is a symbolic return to the neighborhood to celebrate the vibrancy and resiliency of the community that was uprooted from here. So putting on our annual festival, it's a core part of fulfilling our mission, which is to cultivate Japanese-Canadian arts and culture to connect communities. Certainly over the weekend, we hope that you're able to make your own connections, whether it's to other attendees, to cultural aspects of the festival that speak to you, or to your own heritage. And through these connections, we hope that as a society, we can work collaboratively to welcome and celebrate what makes us different, rather than to repeat mistakes of the past. So on behalf of our board of directors, our staff, and our over 200 volunteers that make this happen, we welcome you to the 40th Annual Pal Street Festival. Thank you.
Thank you very much, Colin. Uh, that concludes the opening ceremonies. Thank you all very much to all of our special guests. We really appreciate your attendance. こちらはこれをもちまして閉会式を終了させていただきます。ご来賓の皆様どうもありがとうございました。We have a few announcements for everybody now.